gonna say a regular attack would probably just outright kill him. The frost goblins aren't exactly the sturdiest of foes. Twenty-three damage is pretty good for the dot, I'm not gonna lie. Tusker? Oh, how's Paul doing? Why are you guys gonna be like this? I thought we were cool. Alright, now I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna smack him with this. Finish him off. Oh, really? I thought I had one more dot. <laughs> Wait, that doesn't do anything? Oh! Oh no! That's no bueno. Like, considerably less than bueno. I thought this was just a straight shot. Am I stupid? Well, yeah, probably, but, you know, please don't answer that. Okay, I guess the way forward is... Oh, it's right down here. I am stupid. Part of me wants to like just try and stretch it out and finish these last couple of encounters until I level up so that I just uh, don't have to use my potions. I mean, if I get frost goblins, that shouldn't be too bad. Well, if I... Oh god, those things hit hard when they actually attack, though. Oh god, and it hits twice, I forgot. Alright, I should not play these reindeer games. throw an anger at him. Yeah, no kill like overkill, right? Alright, there we go. I found I found the true shiny place here. And I didn't level up. I thought I would have probably went and picked a fight with everything in the map I probably could have, but you know. Here, look. Do you see them? See what? Caves. There are caves in the mountainside. 
We'll camp tonight and explore the mountainside when we're rested. Demento. I thought all of Galanoth's family had been killed by Akriloth. I'm not Galanoth's brother by birth, Hunter. After Akriloth burned his family's farm to the ground, my family took him in. We became bro blood brothers shortly after that. I see. What happened to make you become blood brothers? Haha. -ha. He was just five years old, but he was already fearless. I mean, uh, watching your... <laughs> watching your uh, uh, home get burned to the ground by a dragon will do one of two things. It'll terrify you for the rest of your life, or it'll desensitize you. I was ten, and apparently looked like good prey. I was out gathering wood for a camp when a wyvern swooped down and grasped me in its claws. Wyverns occasionally take smaller farm animals to feed their brood, but with a krill off out rampaging, I was a much easier prey. The wyvern swooped down and carried me off, and Galanoth ran. It seemed like he jumped ten feet into the air, and he grabbed a hold of my legs and wouldn't let go. Our weight together was too much for the wyvern, and she dropped us back down. Gal saved me from becoming dragon food, and I owe him my life. Anyways, it's time to gather our energy. We have an ancient corrupted guardian to face tomorrow. And we have to convince him to give us the only weapon strong enough to defeat Akriloth. I, I can't believe they're gone. My whole family, wiped out. I've been gone so long. It seems like I've spent years just standing around in Yulder's Forge when I should have been home, if I had been home. You would have been incinerated as well, my young friend. <clears throat> I understand your pain. I lost someone due to the carelessness of someone who I thought was a friend. Oh, man. <laughs> Always with the deep cuts, Suzanne. Just like you. He tried to save. It's, he tried. It's just... He is a hero. He has saved Falcon Reach, faced bandits and monsters. I've even heard rumors that he has a pet dragon. Yeah, I did. did, 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 did. Hey, man. How could he lose so badly to this Akriloff? A hero. That hero in his pathetic band should have saved your family. They only look out for themselves, though. Dalinoth only goes after the dragon. He could have saved your family. Hunter could have led them away. Instead, they were taken from you. My, my own love, my Jania, was taken from me by that misfit mage Warlick. Warlick, but he's good. That's what he wants you to think. But who's here now, offering you help, train you so you can get your revenge? Warlick and his little minion. They even attacked me. They stole my book of power, called me evil. <laughs> All right, the incina or the, the whatever they call the, the. It sounds like the Necronomicon, but why? Jealousy, Conan. <clears throat> Warlick caused the accident that took Jania from me. Is that spelled differently, or am I losing my mind? And now he tries to steal my power back, so I can't get her. They're only interested in their own power, not ours. You have the gift of magic too, Conan. I can show you how to bend fire to your will and how to enchant with it and make it live and make it die. No mere fire dragon will be able to defeat you. And once Akriloth is gone, you can go after the ones that caused your family to die. The one that took Jania away from me. Hunter, Galanoff, and Warlick, all of them. Ha 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 ha
you know, whispering in his ear. We must defeat a Kriloth and bring back something from the frozen Northlands that can take a Kriloth down. All right, now we now we got the caves to deal with. Dragon magic. It's crazy how much I managed to forget before I started playing this game again back a few years ago. Like, um, I completely forgot how often they mention, uh, how often Zan mentions Jania. That's something that I had only really paid attention to and become privy to when I, uh, during one of the quests that I played when I started playing the game again. Back in like 2017 is when I started. It just, I guess I either didn't really pay attention or I just forgot before. Ow. Like I remembered as much as Warlick, in, or well Zan hates Warlick. I remembered that much. But the details of why, like, passed me by. So playing playing the game again from beginning and seeing all these allusions to it are, is actually rather amusing. Sorry, it looks like there's a thing over there. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna move from like hole to hole here. Gotcha. It'll either be this after I kill this frost goblin or the next one that's right in front of me that gets me the level up. Oh. Alright. Time to meet your maker, frost goblin. Ow. I guess it only hits twice some of the time. That's weird. Oh, what? Oh, the nerve. Oh, I guess I found the, uh, I guess I found the boss. Yeah, let me go kill something so I can just get my stats redone. I know it will probably let me heal before, but, you know. Yeah. How? Ooh, ooh. Oh, <laughs> sitting here like, oh, I can't believe this. Well, if, hmm, the next fight will do it. Three fights later, the next next fight will do it. Oh my days! Oh my days! Oh, that didn't even work. Oh, throw only cost four. I don't know why that like slipped my mind. I thought I was. I thought six was like too little mana to do anything. There we go. Level up. Give me that sweet, sweet twenty-one. Twenty health, five mana, five stat points. I will go allocate those stat points at the end of this quest. 
Izoths. I stole all of my treasures fair and square. You shall never take them from me. I am only here for the ice scythe so that we can fe defeat the fire dragon Aquiloth. Never. I do not care if the entire planet is destroyed. No one is ever going to take my treasures. Wow, you need to chill. I spent my entire existence lying, cheating, and stealing to get them. Viva La Raza. Innocent people are being hurt by Akriloth's rampage. You must give me that scythe so that I can defeat him. I mean, this... That is a very spiffy looking weapon. And I want it. Never. You'll have to pry it from my cold, icy talons. As far as I'm concerned, you and the rest of the humans can all burn. Very well then. I challenge you to a duel for the ice scythe. A puny human like you. This should be good. Square up, scumbag. Let's go. Uh, first of all. Uh, okay, he doesn't resist immobility at all, so let's... Uh, let's go for it. Uh, yeah. Da -da 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 Dragon magic, suck it. Alright, we should be in pretty good shape. <clears throat> We're already a little ahead of him as far as HP goes. His attacks don't seem to be do- oh no, he stunned me? I should probably try and evade anyway. <laughs> Let's not be silly here. Not affected by stun. Well, that's good. I'm real happy I decided to evade. That probably would have hurt if I had let it get me. Uh, sure. Ouch. Oh, that wouldn't have been so bad. Yeah, I don't know. If I cannot have the ice scythe, ice scythe. Oh no. Oh no, don't be like this. Come on, be rational. No one will. And, oh, that's cold. Ha. Go kill your fire dragon with that. I don't feel so good. Did I mention that I was keeping all these treasures for my ice dragon master? He's going to be really mad at you. Took it. Just great. How are we going to fe defeat a Akriloth now? Wait, maybe Yolgar can fix this. I'll take him the broken ice scythe right away. Well, Yolgar is pretty good, Conan. 19. 20. Use your anger. Let your revenge fuel you. Ah ha ha. I can't go any further. What? Come on. I only put a hundred pounds on there. Oh, wait a second. I know what you need. <laughs> I forgot about this. The vague final countdown-ness in the background. 
It's only like a 30 second loop. I will avenge your family. Much better. Or my family. Much better. Ha 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 ha. I like how every other interaction has been like serious and sinister and now they just go full silly with it. <laughs> oh man. going to be a big rocky celebration when he gets to the top of the stairs. I. I think the weight got bigger. I'm getting more powerful. I can feel the power flowing through me. Ah, oh no, he's got the he started doing the zan cackle. That's it. Tame the fire. The world will crumble before you. Ha 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 ha. The ice scythe is shattered, but maybe Yulgur can forge something from the pieces.